So I've got a question about using the CNC machine and uh, how capable it is. Uh, is it just a pure hobby toy or can you actually do anything useful? Well, I thought I'd do a very quick video on the things that I've made so far. I'll quickly talk you through them. These are engraved acrylic um, little coasters. Um, so they're quite nice. Um, there's a set of those. Um, I've tried cutting pine. That is probably about 18 mil pine, and you can see it cuts very, very nicely. Um, these numbers, these are acrylic on wood, so the top part is acrylic. This is a house number plate, and we'll go on the house at some point. And the bottom is pine, uh, painted, so cut and painted pine. Um, again, there a couple of numbers there, so, so, and you can see it's quite a nice cut. Yeah, so it does cut material as well as engraved material, and these coasters have been cut as well as engraved through the machine. And I've done the same with the wooden coasters here. So fully cut and engraved from start to finish on this very machine. And something a little bit more adventurous was this unit here. This little uh, tool holder I made is out of pine. It's uh, probably 20 mil pine, I think, and you can see it's cut out the inside. I made a little lip there, so uh, and that was something really challenging because I didn't think the machine was capable of cutting such thick wood, but clearly it was able to do it. Uh, that's a little sign that I showed earlier in the last video. Um, this is, uh, I'm not sure what the wood was, but it's a hard wood. Uh, it's a lot thinner, it's about 5-6 mil, but it, it's a very nice clean cut. Sorry, it's losing focus a bit, but there you go. You can see it's a very nice clean cut. Um, there's a money clip there. Uh, and this box, this box, the edges of all, it was four bits of acrylic engraved and stuck together. The wood at the top and the bottom, again, this is a hard wood. It was cut uh, as well as a handle uh, using this, the machine. And there you go, you can see that was also all done by the machine. And finally, um, a little, this is just an experiment. There's a little phone tea biscuit holder. I've done a separate video on this. So if you look through my videos, you'll see a video on the making of this using easel software and using this very machine. Um, I did it for the purpose of the video more than the actual product itself. But uh, yeah, there you go. So you can make useful things. And this machine is more capable than just a simple being, you know, playing the role of a simple engraver. It can cut material and quite thick material, hardwood, softwoods alike. So I hope that was some use.